If you're not covering your RV when it's in storage, chances are it's because you think RV covers are either too expensive or too hard to use, or more likely both. I can tell you this, the money you spend on an RV cover, you'll more than get back in saved maintenance expenses and higher resale value. So that aside, I'm gonna to try to show you how you can simplify the installation of an RV cover to put you more at ease with the idea of covering your RV and protecting that RV investment. Put your gloves on, it gets a little grimy up here on the roof, and please do be sure you wear non-skid shoes. You'll have to be comfortable with being on the roof of your RV, and by the way, a helper would be well helpful. The first step is to install the downspout covers if they're provided. If not, I hear toilet paper rolls or pool noodles, among other things, can be used to cover the downspouts and keep the cover from tearing on those sharp edges. Make a quick trip up on the roof to be sure it's clear of debris and to fold down or remove any antennas that could snag the cover. Back down on terra firma. Pile the cover directly behind the RV with the front label on top. A little tip here, when you store the cover, unzip the access panels and bag it with the front label on top. So next time you're doing this, it comes out of the bag ready to install. Then gather up an armful of the cover and head up the ladder. Be careful here not to take too much cover that it might throw you off balance or prevent you from keeping a firm grip on the ladder. Once on top, pull the cover up and work it forward along the center of the roof. As you push the front of the cover toward the front of the RV and work the rest of the cover onto the roof, it's a bit like a giant inchworm. Be patient and try not to grab too much at once. And if the breeze is blowing, do be extra careful to keep the cover from getting caught in the wind. This is where a helper can come in very handy by grabbing the upwind side of the cover from the ground and holding it down so it doesn't get caught in the wind while you're spreading it out on the roof. Once you've got the cover onto the roof and evenly distributed from front to back, cascade the cover over the front and front corners, taking care not to snag on the downspouts. If you're covering a motorhome, this is where you'll need to be sure to get the cover over the side view mirrors as well. Again, a helper can assist here to more easily get the cover down, pulled over the corners and draped over the front. Work your way back along each side of the RV, pushing the cover over bit by bit as you go. There are a couple of tricky parts here. One, that pesky wind can mess with your technique, so just be patient and get your helper on the upwind side. Two, as you are getting the cover spread across the roof, you have to kind of remember where the vents, antennas, and skylights are, and take extra care to step lightly as you go. Breaking one of those components, or worse, tripping on one of them, could definitely ruin your day. We use one of the new Elements covers from Camping World, which has the white Tyvek roof panel. It's oversized and intended to drape slightly over the sides, so I'm also taking a little extra care to get the cover as close to centered side to side as I can. This cover also has two seams that indicate the center of the cover, so I also use that to check center as I go. Once you're down off the roof, it'll be harder to center the cover as it tends to snag on all those roof components I mentioned. Since I don't have an installed ladder on my trailer, I drop some of the cover over the back, climb down, move the ladder, then pull the rest of the cover down. Buckle the tension straps on the rear and front caps of the cover. Zip the access panels closed if you had them unzipped. Check that the corners are covered, then work your way around to get all the hold down straps connected and cinched. Finally, cinch up those front and rear straps and your covered RV should look something like this. Your RV is protected from the elements and will stay looking great for many road trips to come.